Hello friends, today I am going to show you how to make sonar using Arduino with the Nokia 5110 display. First, let us integrate LCD display with Arduino. For that, we need to add UHG2 library on our Arduino ID. You can refer their GitHub repository for documentation. So, now I am going to copy an example code from there. Replace initial setup with Nokia 5110. Then now let us check our code on board. Set up our Nokia 5110 display circuit as shown in circuit diagram. Yes, it is perfectly working with the example program. Next, we need to create an animated dial display. Let us do that right now. So, first draw a semi-circle. For that you can use draw circle function from LCD display library. Draw it with 41 pixel radius and 40 to 48 as center. Next, we need to draw needle for dial. For that, let us use draw line function from the display library. For making dial animation, we need to make one end as fixed and other is variable through circle arc. For finding variable points, we need to convert each angle into xy points with radius. So, let us use this equation for our display. Next, we need to clear LCD display then send data to LCD display for clearing LCD display there is a built-in function called clear buffer after that we need to send our data to LCD display so there is a built-in function called send buffer 
add a small delay for animation. Copy the same code for opposite direction and make loop to iterate backward. So we will get a swipe animation. Next step is to integrate servo motor. First include servo library, then create a servo object and attach a pin to servo. Next map angle value to servo. Now let us connect the servo with our Arduino. For that we need to make an adapter like this.
our last part is ultrasonic sensor so let us integrate it with Arduino in order to generate the ultrasound you need to set the trigger on a high state for 10 microsecond that will send a sonic sound and it will be received by echo pin the echo pin will output the time in microsecond the sound wave traveled from that you can calculate the distance from the object now let us connect our sensor with Arduino Now we can watch our value using serial monitor. Next we need to store the distance values if it is in our range. Here let us use 40 cm as limb. Use an array of size 180. Each index corresponds to angle. Next step is to draw lines for object located. We need to draw it every angle that we located. For that, let us use an for loop. That lines will uh, create a black shadow. For drawing lines, we need two points that starting and ending. One point will depend on the radius of main arc, and other will depend on the distance from the object. almost completed now. Next we need to remove the previous values that stored in the array.
now let us add a small grid into our display for that draw three circles with radius 10 20 30 respectively now let us look that on our device Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel for more videos.